football has a long history in Mexico, dating back over 100 years. But the popularity of the sport really grew in the 1970s when the NFL started broadcasting their games on cable television. Over the last 20 years, the popularity of the sport has more than doubled. They now have 27 million fans across the country. Gridiron football was first played in Mexico back in 1896, and by the late 1920s, Mexican universities were playing the sport and its popularity began to grow. But not just at the collegiate level. The game took root in Mexico at all levels. It is Wednesday night in Monterey, Mexico, and we are at Vaqueros Field. There is tackle football happening on the field. There is flag football happening. This club has been around for 50 years, and there are over 5,000 kids in the Monterey area playing football, 250 out of this club alone. We were surprised to see so many families here tonight because there's not even a game happening. It's just a practice night. It's incredible to see everything going on in and around the stadium. Take a look. Mexico has an incredibly strong football culture. There's flag and tackle football for boys and girls that are playing the game. And on top of that, there's an incredibly strong college football program. There are 34 teams across the country. And with the LFA starting here in 2016, those players now have an opportunity to play gridiron football professionally on their home turf because Mexico is the fastest growing football market in the world. Right now, uh, we have a playing like uh, 205,000 people around the country. Peewee football, youth football, and, uh, college football and professional football, also senior football. Also we have women playing 11, playing arena, and Tochito also known as club football. So with roots that go back over a century and a thriving game at the grassroots level, why did it take so long for there to be a professional league? Well, it turns out the LFA isn't the first kick at the can. In the early 90s, there was the Master League, a four-team league that became very popular with fans, but after a few seasons, ownership issues sank the league. In 2016, professional football returned to Mexico with the LFA. Now the league boasts eight franchises, with four of them based around Mexico City and four other clubs elsewhere, with plans to expand to 12 teams battling for their chance to win at the Tazón Mexico, the Mexico Bowl. In just four seasons, the fan base has grown 200% as Mexicans continue the love affair with gridiron football. And with the CFL expressing interest in hosting a game in Mexico in the future, and several LFA players drafted into our league, soon they will be introduced to the Canadian brand of football as well. 